evening, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome, welcome to a party. In spite of the weather, we want to welcome you. It's not really a party, it's more a celebration, a dedication, a, a festival, an event, also a monumental achievement all rolled into one. And it's also a party. <laughs> I'm Danny Kay, and I'm speaking to you live and wet from Epcot Center. This is the realization of Walt Disney's dream to create a permanent showcase of technology and world culture. It's a living monument to past achievements and a testament to the hopes of the future. A future where the quality of life for all people will be improved. It's with this spirit in mind that I'd like you all to share with me the wonder and the excitement of this truly remarkable place. Why don't you come with me as we look forward to the dawning of the 21st century. The 21st century's here. It's time for the dream to come true. This glorious figment of one man's imagination. It started a long time ago. Continued to flower and grow. From the marvelous mind of that magical man, now the theme of the dream and the fabulous plan are born and just bust in to get underway. And the 21st century begins today. The 21st century's now. There's history happening here. Before you, you see how the dream reached its culmination. The most thrilling sight one could see With visions of things yet to be A brilliant design of incredible scope Constructed of miracles, magic and hope And a new kind of joy for this weary old sphere And the 21st century begins right here With fantasies that you can touch and feel The world of Epcot's all around you But it's no fantasy No fantasy It's all Magnificent dream realized. But but maybe you're asking yourselves, oh, what's an Epcot? Well, that's a good question. Is it just another amusement park? No. Number one, Epcot is the experimental prototype community of tomorrow. And number two, Epcot isn't just an anything. Oh no. It isn't just a resort, it isn't just a world's fair, not just a cavalcade of wizardry, technology, and flair. It's not just Epicurean displays by international gourmets where one can dine, lunch, munch, crunch for days and days and days. Not just a festival of music, dance, the arts, or education, nor a pageant for the senses sparked by wild imagination. Not just communication, nor the bounty of the land. Not just the world of motion, nor the ocean or the sand. It's not just transportation, nor light or sight or sound. Not just satellites in space, nor the fossils underground. Where Epcot is concerned, there ain't no just about it. Epcot isn't just in anything, it's everything and more. A great deal more than anything the world has seen before. The perfect planned community, the splendorific sprawl. And Epcot Center is the heart of it all. Just so there's no confusion, Epcot Center is located in the center of Epcot. And Epcot Center is made up of two parts, which is Future World and the World Showcase. It's 2.5 miles from the Magic Kingdom, which is also part of Epcot, which is what the 
entire 27,000 acre area known as the experimental prototype community of tomorrow or Epcot or Walt Disney World is called. <laughs> Just so there's no confusion. I hear a thousand voices loud and strong. Because these people know how 